Hello everyone, my name is James, and welcome to Halo 4 This Week. Halo 4 This Week, from September 3rd to September 9th, 2012. I apologize, this episode's gonna be really short and not as advanced as the last ones. Uh, I've just been busy with college, all that life stuff, and I'm going to college tomorrow. It's been really, really action-packed, and I'm going to try to get this get this, Halo, this show back to normal next week, but for now, it's going to be kind of short. My apologies. Really quick, we got some new details on the enemies. Uh, there's only going to be three enemy classes, Crawler, Watcher, and Knight, but there's many versions of it. You know, here's, here's the regular Crawler, probably going to be as annoying as ever, crawling around all over the damn place. This is the regular class of the Crawler. The next Crawler is going to be the Crawler Sniper, which is kind of like the Jackal. As you can see, it has a bit more armor on the uh, back, a bit on its arm, and a bit on its, uh, actually, no, its shoulder and its head. It's bit built for sniping, so it's probably going to have the binary the binary rifle, which is here right now. The binary rifle is the equivalent to probably the sniper rifle um, and the beam rifle on the Covenant, and uh, it's sniper we have. I don't think we've gotten like a first-person perspective of the binary rifle yet. But yeah, I am enjoying these Promethean weapons. They look really cool. The binary rifle is a pretty cool name. The next enemy class is the Watcher. I have not seen any, uh, you know, different classes on the Watcher itself. We've only seen different classes on the Crawler and on the uh, Knight. So I don't know if there's going to be any different versions of the Watcher. There may or be, there there may or may not be any different classes. Next one is probably the most badass thing I've seen is the Knight Battle Wagon. This is like the Knight Commando, or uh, you know, like there's a Knight Minor, Knight Major, Knight like. Zealot. This is like the Knight Zealot. Uh, very awesome. Very cool. I like the way he looks. Next one is the Scatter Shot, which we've seen before. Scatter Shot. I think all the Promethean Knights hold them. And yeah, uh, the Scatter Shot is, is you know like a shotgun, and you shoot them. And all pro all Promethean weapons make you uh, disintegrate, which should be great for Machinima. Next one is the Light Rifle, which is the equivalent to the DMR, probably the Battle Rifle 2 and the Carbine. Um, yeah, I, it, it seems like the Promethean weapons are pretty much the same as the UNSC and Covenant. They're just, you know, a little bit different because, you know, to match the uh, UNSC and Covenant. Next one is the Promethean Commander. Okay, I guess it... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I said Commander Minor, Commander Major. So it, this, is, this is a Knight Commander. And then it goes like Knight Zealot. Uh, looks pretty cool. The back is all holographic. Next one is really fucking awesome. Alpha Crawler. I think this is, yeah, yeah, uh, more dangerous than the standard uh, alpha packs of crawlers. Luckily, alphas can be identified as hard spikes. They have spikes. It looks really cool. Um, and they use suppressors as ranged weapons. Really awesome. Next one is the regular knight. Um, not much difference from the uh, commander knight, except the back isn't so, you know, yellow holographic. But, uh, yeah, you know, um, I'm really liking the way that the Prometheans look. They look really cool. I kind of wish that there was more than just three, but, you know, probably in Halo 5 and 6 we'll see more. Here's the freaking Knight Lancer. Like, look at this. That looks really cool. Um, yeah, they use uh, Vision to track targets. They, they will probably sit, like these guys would probably use the uh, Promethean Vision. Plus, they have that like axe thing on their arm. Next one is a pulse grenade. This looks very low graphic detailed. I honestly have to say the graphics on this grenade look pretty shitty, honestly. But I'm sure it's gonna look better in the game. And it's it's pretty much an EMP grenade. You throw it in and it bursts like EMP and out to everybody. Next one is the equivalent to the Fuel Rod Cannon, probably the Rocket Launcher, maybe the Spartan Laser, it's the Incinerary Cannon. Uh, and it's really cool, it shoots fire and it, like, it ignites the ground, so it's like a flamethrower cannon type of weapon. Very awesome gun. Can't wait to use it. Next weapon is really cool that I want to use, it's called the Suppressor, I saw a bit of this at E3. Um, it pretty much, it's like the uh, equivalent to the uh, Assault Rifle. Um, it just shoots out little bolts of, uh, I guess, fire? I guess all the Prometheus weapons shoot fire, I, I, I guess. Maybe that's why they incinerate, because they, you know, burn up. Here's the bolt shot, equivalent to the pistol, plasma pistol, it shoots flame little bolts. See, so yeah, I think all Promethean weapons shoot fire in a certain way, like, or plasma. Next up, they said that they were going to make a map remake in Halo 4. I personally think it's Sand Trap. Let me know which map you think it's going to be. I really hope it's Sand Trap. I love Sand Trap from Halo 3, and I really wanted to see it remade. Uh, plus they made freaking sandbox. I hope it's sand trap and I hope that they like expand it. Plus they said it was gonna be a big map. So question to all you all. Which map do you think will be remade in Halo 4? I personally think, like I said, sand trap, but it could be other big maps. They said it was a big map. I hope it's not from Halo 1 or Halo 2. Or you know what? Just give me a really awesome big map. Uh, I think it's sand trap. Let me know. Thank you for watching. Next week's episode will try to be more standard and up to par. Thanks for watching again. Have a good one. Bye.